Dude, this door sucks, dude. Oh! Oh, yes. oh I got it! Uh, I don't want to fall back. You see that would that would make sense a little. Bit. <laughs> it's leaving a crap trail. Hey! hey, 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 hey. Talking big smack about Dorothy? I am. She's such Whoa, a great client. Shoot. Do you see what's in here? This is like a landscaper's worst nightmare. <laughs> Frick, you only got one ground on there. But we're good. Be careful here. So when I pull forward, I don't tear my door off. Right. All right. Little ground issue, we're good though. Yep. You got a rake in there, that thing's gonna get buried. Oh shoot, I forgot about that thing. Hold up, hold up. Or I'll grab it. I don't think that. I don't think that was the smartest idea. Yeah, there's a lot of weight in this thing. Whoa, buddy. I'm a hey, you would not want to stand there. No, you'd be dead. Yeah, <laughs> literally. Like a, it's like a leap apple. <laughs> All right, got a little bit of a situation here. Hey, hold up, hold up, back up. All right, and you're good. Just keep going forward. I just crushed my door. Yeah, Next I know. Time, instead of standing there on the trailer, keep my door open. He's pissed. Yeah. Flashback. When I pull forward, I don't tear my door off. End of flashback. Shoot. Shoot, dog. Frick. Almost Whoa. tore my ankle off. Frick. Ooh. 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 Uh -huh. An extremely annoying shift later. Oh look, he's got a got a safe pass. Besides that one. Rain or shine, day or night, snow or hail, summertime or winter, we will get your grass mowed. What the living crap, dude? This is like the tenth time today. Explain what you did. It's just the the ground. It's kind of like severely moist. You severely know. moist a and it kind of just my foot don't <laughs> even fit <laughs> <laughs> so right now this is in stock mode um just regular spring tension and we're going to show you how fast the mower goes all right so it's going to press down slowly on that so that's not bad it's a bit slow what we're going to do is we're going to adjust the spring Here's Max Wrist Ultra Extreme. <laughs> and what we're gonna do is we're gonna jury rig it, bend the spring actually, um, to give it some more wrist. And then we're gonna stretch that baby all the way up top here, hook it up on, on whatever That's, that is. That is the definition of Max Wrist. This is, <laughs> that is tight. <laughs> It's 
still cuts pretty, pretty good. You know what, I, James, I, I think it's just about time that I pull my head out of my ass, start stretching my own dick around because what I did that, that last lawn was uh, pretty horrible. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to cut to you now. Well, I don't ever do mowing vlogs. I want to, but you know, I haven't. So let's go ahead and send this first step one, see how we do here, all right? Let's get some good shots. What we're doing is we came to this Kleist property, we're gonna pick up the leaves. Uh, we started at, shoot, what time was it? 12.30, I think. Um, yeah, we'll see what time we get done. This is just from like one dump of the hopper, the hopper got full. It's going a bit slower than it needs to, but yeah, just one dump from the hopper. We got a decent edge here. I wasn't trying to make a perfect edge, but just clean it up a little bit. So again, this is like what? Our fourth, fifth, sixth dump? Sixth dump. POV action. Frick. Holy crap. <laughs> hey, you got 
got some trees going here. Oof. So, it took an hour and about five minutes. So, I'm just gonna run through a few things on how I'm gonna charge that, what I'll charge for that. And, I mean, this is a half, shoot, maybe 20 minute drive out here. So it's a bit longer than all my other ones. And I'm just, I gotta charge, cause haul my trailer and truck all the way out here. Gotta charge for time, pay employee, gas, wear and tear, just all that stuff. So that's gonna add up a little bit. Um, and then, you know, as you've seen, it was pine needles. And if you don't have a walker or something that sucks up leaves really well, I believe that the walker is the only thing that really can suck up leaves and pine needles and stuff like that that well. Because it has the GHS turbine in there sucking it from the deck. The deck's you know sucking it into the chute and then the GHS turbine is sucking it into the hopper. It's a really great system for picking up stuff and that's the reason why I have it. It's going to pay itself off. So, you can't charge less just because it took less time. You gotta pay for your equipment. I mean, just think how long it would took you if you're gonna rake, probably like four hours, five hours. And at say, I mean, shoot, maybe longer, just say five hours for you know one man and you charge 25, 30 bucks an hour. What is that, 150 bucks? Well, that's exactly what I was planning on charging anyways. I was gonna charge around 140, 150 for that job. It took us one hour, but we have two guys here. Um, how do you get on the interstate? Oh, I see it. Should I just go on the like wrong wave? That'd be kind of funny. Yeah, it'd be good. What would it be? 75 an hour, which is all right. I mean, I like to get $100 an hour per person, but we also, you know, we have one boss here in the employee, so you don't have to charge that much. You know, you want to get a dollar a minute for Bowen, which if I were doing that, would be, you know, 120 overall for, you know, two hours, but I'm doing better than that. You got to include that. There's a dump fee right there and, a, and my time going to Eco Compost. That's a place here around here that we can dump. That's my time that we have to go there and dump that. So you got to include that in. So $150 for it's going to end up being, you know, two hours or more of work. That's pretty fair. Um, you know, we have two guys, so really four man hours. And that's just the way I charge. I like to get around 50 to $100 an hour. That's what I really shoot for. If you want to stay in business full time as, you know, a real business owner, you have to get that amount. And especially when you have expensive equipment. I don't have extremely expensive equipment right now. You know, what do I have? Just truck and trailer and a walker and some other stuff. I had two walkers, but I sold that one. I wasn't paying for itself, so I got rid of it. Anyways, just figure I'd let you in on that and get a good employee. If your employee doesn't make you money, get rid of him. That's why you hire someone is to make you money. To 26 horsepower. How, how big are the decks? Oh, that's how, how wide. 48. Yeah. Okay. I wouldn't get anything less than a 48. I had a 36. Yeah, that thing was It too has small. its place, but it's way too small. Oh, shoot. Um, I was just booking through a 50 <laughs> mile hour zone at like 75. Shoot, it's, we're in a construction zone, as you can see. You got a pine needle in your nose, buddy? You need some help there? Oh, workers. Workers! weather that it has been occurring today it's raining it's been it's gonna rain this whole week so we're trying to get these last lawns done for the whole year it's kind of sucking not gonna lie <laughs> 